Here we go, here we go, welcome to my Tiguga place for you, this is my Tiguga and we got to episode 7 of RimWorld HSK Mod Pack, the university, yes, a let's play series tutorial with tips and hints for anyone that wants to play this awesome mod pack that is HSK or HCSK, Hardcore SK. Yes, many names. You guys can join us at our Discord and learn a lot uh, about the game. There's a nice, very friendly community there that will help you with any of your needs. Also, uh, you feel free to join the Mighty Google Discord if you want. Uh, there's uh, invites right below on the comment section. And guys, come on, let me know what you think what you're thinking about this uh, by means of comments, you know, give me some likes if you want this to keep on going, uh, if you're liking this series, and let me know if there's anything I can do to improve or, or else, and of course I want to know as well if you were playing this game particularly, what would have you done differently from what I'm doing. Let's learn together, guys. Okay, let's get to the game. And as I said in the, on the previous episode, I was playing it uh, off camera for a little bit. Just to get our things going. And I just stopped in and started to recording this episode. Because we got a new uh, element to our colony. Ashtargalon. Yes, Ashtargalon. He's a member of our Discord, a very helpful guy, and he's just arrived. He called us and said, hey, I need some shelter. There's bad guys coming after me. And I said, yes, come on in. He's a very nice uh, colonist. With uh, He's probably going to be a soldier, a construction soldier. He's a careful shooter. A little bit nervous, but that's okay. Um... He's a space refugee and, and he has just joined and he's coming home uh, to his new colony and his new brothers and sisters and right behind him there's this raid. Collins, Clans and Stump are coming behind him trying to get him back to the slave camps of South Rimworld. So we're not gonna let that happen and that's why this episode starts right here. But before we get into battle, come on guys, see our new kitchen. I improved our kitchen a little bit, I just uh, increased the size of it so it's uh, nice and uh, symmetric. I had to build another cold stone battery. It was a waste. I had to mine it a little bit more. I just found out there's a, a little bit of uh, a cold stone right here on the map. Where was it? Where was it? Yes, right here, closer to our base. So I mined it a little bit and got some more cold stone. And now we have a fine crispy minus four degrees Celsius in our freezer which is preventing our food to uh, our food to rot I still have to get those uh, rotted mush and rotted meat outside our fridge but we'll be doing that soon enough I also start harvesting some hay so we can build beds and maybe tame some animals uh, but now let's get Cut to the cut the chase. Let's get to the battle. Our guys are positioned. Rebecca is a very strong melee fighter, melee fighter. Uh, Adenia as well has a nice melee, but she's also very good at shooting. Guga is very good at shooting and very good at melee. And I have Queen here just uh, hanging around with an axe in case we need to chop someone's hands off. Right. So the raid is going on. Uh, they are coming. Ash safe and sound at our colony. I already uh, assigned work for him. It's going to be our designated constructor together with Adania. And maybe do a little crafting as well. Uh, we're going to be needing to build some beds really, really soon. So we're going to do that right after we fight those guys. So Guga is already shooting them. Let's see. Yeah. So they're coming over and by means of planning ahead you know when you get uh, this kind of raid this is a small raid yet it's not a huge massacre or anything they are only armed with melee weapons so we're gonna be fine I guess uh, but it's nice for us to understand who are we gonna be uh, since we only have a place for one prisoner who are we gonna be uh, imprisoning 
Uh, and this is very important at this stage of my game specifically because Adenia is, uh, or Rebecca, I'm not sure who, I think it's Rebecca, she has a bonus uh, event that happened to her that she's inspired to recruit. So whoever we capture is going to be recruited to the colony. So we got to be, uh, we can't wait longer, so we got to have to choose between those three guys. Let's see, Clans. Uh, he's physically sensitive, skilled medic, uh, and a body purist. He doesn't like bionics on his stuff. Well, a, a, a good medic would be very nice for our colony right now. Let's see Stomp. Stomp hates cleaning. So this guy is gonna... He hates cleaning and howling, so it's not gonna be able to do that very well. Um, so this guy is a goner. He's probably gonna be the, the first to run. So between Collins, which is a fast learner, jogger, and nervous, uh, he has a nice intellectual, so we could uh, make him work solely on research, which is nice. And he also has a good uh, hand for planting. Maybe in the future we can use him. Uh, and so it's between him and Clance. And Clance... I would like to get both to, to, to tell you the truth, but you know what? Uh, between those two guys, I'm gonna go with Collins. If he survives, we just destroyed his his lungs, so I'm not gonna sure we're gonna he's gonna make it. Come on, he's down. That's good. Let's see how many hours we have before. Well, probably not gonna be able to get him. Probably gonna have to get Clans. Yep, they're leaving. Should he kick stamp? Let's let's kick stamp. Yes, everyone is down. So now Guga, you're gonna be uh, stabilize. Oh, you cannot stabilize him. So let's capture Collins as quick as as we can. Uh, GG, you're gonna finish stomp. No, but before you do, you gotta strip him. Before you do, you're gonna strip stomp. What are we going to do with clans? We don't have another another prison to work with clans. It's a hard decision. He's a good medic, but you know, he's a body purist. He has none. Let's see Collins. I haven't checked for Collins. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna end. Glances. And now, GG, you can finish off Stomp. And now, Adenia, you can finish off Glance. In the name of Ash, we killed your raiders and we got one to tell the history. Let's see if we can save Collins. It's not going to be called Collins. We're going to name him something else. But for now, we got a whole bunch of new weapons, clothing. Uh, all you have to do is bury those guys on our mass grave over here. And we're going to be fine, fine, fine. Now, all you have to do is save Collins. We need to save Collins. We have medicine. Come on, Collins. Come on, Collins. Come on, Guga. Ash is right over here. He's playing stuff. We need new beds. Before we do anything, let's tell them to, to build some beds. Beds, 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 beds. Do we need simple bed? No. We're gonna make a mattress bed. Yes. With um, blue. And we're gonna make a bed right here. And one also right here. And one right here. Yes. Three beds will be enough. Alright. So. We need to save him. Tending to columns. Google is already on it. How much time we have? We still have two hours. We have one idle colonist, which is Ash, because we gotta restrict this guy, of course. Let's copy these orders and let's place it over here. Ash, we need you to go build stuff. Come on, man. We just saved your ass. 
Oh, there's gonna be some hauling, some burying, and we're gonna be saving Collins. Let's go to prisoner, prisoner, prisoner. Yes, let's give him full uh, medical apparatus. So, and we're gonna try to recruit him. And Rebecca. It's gonna be the first one to recruit Collins. I think it's Rebecca that has the. Maybe you can see the history here. Messages. Inspired recruitment, Rebecca. Yes, now she will successfully recruit anyone that she tries. So the first time she tries to recruit Collins, she's gonna get it. Collins is stable. His right lung is destroyed. He's not gonna be as good as a normal colonist, but doesn't matter. Who has minor break risk? Kid, why? Alright, Collins is stable now. And Rebecca will come... Where is Rebecca, by the way? Oh, Rebecca went to Barry. Is she coming to recruit? No. No, she's just dropping stuff. Alright, and our beds are being produced, which is great. People are gonna love that. We still have lots of planks, so we can probably improve our... Our... And I installed a new mod, yes. Uh, I installed this mod. It's totally compatible with HS... Okay, which is etch wall. We can etch those holes. Can we etch, etch those holes? No, we cannot. Can we decorate? No, we cannot because those are not proper walls. Those are weathered sandstone. Those are not proper cave walls. So it's okay. Doesn't matter. We probably should tell for. Uh, a beauty standpoint, you know, let's let's mine those. Who has tethered apparel? Ash. But Ash, you can change your apparel anywhere. Anytime you want. Did we tell him to tell her to recruit? Yes, he's in recruit mode. So she he's I'm not I don't know if this is gonna fly because uh, we need 18 hours at least. Oh, GG created a masterwork bed. That's nice. Is this one? Yeah. So, I'm gonna give this one to Kid. I'm gonna give this one to Rebecca. And I'm gonna give this one to Ash. Alright, so everyone now has has beds, which is great. We're not going to be needing these anymore. We can leave it for guests or anything else. Maybe we can build a guest room right here. One thing that I want, though, guys, is to make a medical bed. You know, what is this? Relation with complete treaties of urban have changed for 31 to 45. Valentine exit the map healthy. That's nice. There's probably another one on the way. Let me see if it this didn't happen. Nope. This didn't happen yet. Hasn't happened yet. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yep. Lots of cold stone. Our freezer is doing fine. Our food is doing fine. We have enough hay to build more beds. Oh, so I was talking to you guys. I want to make leather beds. L not leather beds, medical beds made out of reptile leather. And why do I want to do that? Because I know for a fact that when you build beds with reptile leather, your immunity gain factor for those beds is increased. So they're nice medical beds. Uh, beds that we want. What is this? Oh, she's gonna be building the log wall. Soon enough, they're, they're sleeping outside for now, but we will fix this uh, soon enough. But So, how do we find reptiles? Alright, I'm going to go to wild animals, and I'm going to try to find... There's cockroaches, where? 
they're not gonna bother us for now. Uh, we want tortoises. So we have three tortoises. I'm gonna tell the hunter to hunt those tortoises. Maybe we should tame them and like, I don't know, make them raise them and try to butcher the offspring. Colin shut his no Oh, he's no longer one. Let's see his prisoner status in 10 hours. Let's hope Rebecca keeps her inspiration. They're gonna be feeding Collins. I'm gonna tell to cook a little bit more meat so we keep on that. Maybe make a bio fruit salads. Yes, let's add some fruit salads to the place. 10 hours, how many hours have passed since then? Come on, we need this. We want Collins. We want Collins. 5 hours. Where is Zoom Root? Why? Ah, oh! She did it! Yay! Rebecca! 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 Yes! The wild woman made it! And now we have Collins, a new recruit. Now we have lots of people, guys. Come on, we have seven people. We're gonna have to start worrying about food more. Collins um, is going to get some clothing. And let's see what he's going to be working on. Oh, he's gonna be a researcher, right? Yeah, he's gonna be a researcher. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have, leave him with basic holly and cleaning tasks, uh, with basic plant cutting and grow and negotiate maybe and warden. Yes, we need wardens. I'm gonna tell Rebecca to go back to cooking before anything. Let's see if she equipped the knife. I changed it a little bit, so I gave the knife to to her, uh, and she used to have the pickaxe, but now that we have other weapons and she's good, uh, maybe I should give her the great sword. Yes, I'm gonna give her the great sword. Let's assign that to her. Rebecca, I'm gonna give here, and I'm gonna... There's a glaive, the glaive is over here. I'm just gonna give her the... Nah, let's give her the glaive, yes. And let's take that pickaxe out of her hand. We need a weapons bench, ASAP. Uh, maybe we do have the enough... Uh, yes, we do have enough uh, bricks to build that, which is going to be great. Uh, let's let's uh, create... Oh, let's change Collins. His health is a little bit bad, but it's okay. We're gonna change Collins to Sidfu. Yes, welcome Sidfu to our colony. Everything is forgotten with Ash. I know you tried to kill him, but hopefully that's past waters. Waters over the bridge. And since you are such a nice guy, I'm gonna give you. Oh, we don't. We, we still don't have a, a loadout. So I'm gonna give you a new loadout. It's gonna be called Seed Foo. Yes. Not any drugs. I'm gonna give you the Great Sword. Yeah. There you go. Now we have people that can uh, defend defend our colony. We finish harvesting this area over here and I think it's time for us to start hunting again. Uh, we are almost at the end of summer uh, and who's gonna be hunting? I think Sidfu doesn't have a bed. We need to build a bed for Sidfu. We need to build lots of things. So I'm gonna go with a woodlock wall over here and over here. I'm gonna try to build another bed, furniture, 
simple bed. We have blue. This bed over here. These are gonna be the rooms of our colonists. Yeah, we need to improve that soon enough, but that's not gonna happen right now. Maybe even build another thing right here. Oh, remember our chunks? Making a natural barrier for any sneaky guys that want to cross over to our colony from this side of the map. Yes, everything's gonna be happening right here, guys. Right here. What is this? Oh, it's just a stone. Oh my, don't mind me. Let's go! Food is fine. It's time for us to build the beds, build the walls. And also, I'm gonna create a weapon scrap made out of granite. It doesn't matter that's granite, you know, granite is better for building walls because it has a higher durability range, but you know, it just doesn't matter. We are almost at a point that we could probably expand this as well. Um, I think I'm thinking about yes. Let's. One thing that I wanted to do uh, was structure. No zone area, build roof area. I'm gonna make a ledge here, just so I can create a stockpile. Uh, I'm gonna make black stockpile over here for our rotted stuff, you know. And this is gonna be uh, so it's gonna be mush. Oops, 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 mush. Uh, rotted mush and rotten meat. Rotten meat, and I'm gonna take this out of here. We have to create an um, uh, overhang over here, because if it's directly exposed, it will deteriorate in the environment, so we don't want that. And now we have more space for more meat and stuff like that, which means we're gonna be able to be hunting some more muffalos, and that's what I'm gonna be doing. Oh, he's also hunting for... For uh, I think Guga is hunting for tortoise. Did we get any tortoise yet? Oh yes, lizard ladder. Yes, that's what I meant. I didn't mean um, reptile ladder. It's lizard ladder. But we need more than that. We, I think we need forty to make a medi uh, good medical bed. Yes, we need forty lizard. Oop, oops. Guga, Guga, you gotta make this. Is he gonna make it? Let's see. Yeah, he's gonna make it. Right, come on. Yeah. That was close, man. That was close. Very nice. We need to build uh, doors for those guys as well. We also need to build some floors. I think it's time for floors on our bedrooms. There are small bedrooms. I'm using a mod that uh, allows for smaller bedrooms, so it doesn't have any debuffs. It's called a uh, realistic rooms mod, and you know, uh, I think it's a three by three would be a very, you know, it would be a nice room nice quarter it's not a house you know like if you have a five by five you start having like uh, a very nice room oh again oh but he's down already what are you not gonna get this is he's, he's dead no get this first don't start leaving corpses I have more meat, we have more furs, and we're gonna be able to produce clothing and, and stuff out of that. And we only have 36 almost there. Do, do we have more tortoises? 
we don't have more tortoises and we don't have more reptiles I think we don't we don't but it's all right it's all good so Rebecca is chilling maybe we should build another a couple more benches since we have seven people this is the table that I want and I do have the planks for it we're gonna be we're gonna have to we're gonna be thinking about more planking real soon. Who's starving? Why are you starving, Ash? Why are you consuming rotted meat? Why? I don't want you to consume rotted meat. Oh! This lock mod is a nuisance, man. It always leaves someone behind, you know, like seed foo. And but I'm sure this is not locked, this one over here. It's unlocked. No, you're not gonna be consuming that. You're gonna be consuming fried assorts. You're starving, but not for long, man. Not for long. I should unlock this, man. I'm unlocking it. Seedfoo's up and running, and I'm gonna give this bed to Seedfoo. Nope. I want set owner Seedfoo. Great. We are doing fine. We are doing fine. Soon enough, we're gonna have probably to build uh, ways of heating the area. Ash, why are you not sleeping in your bed? I gave this to you, Ash. Oh, this is locked. God dang it. Google, wake up and, you know, change the freaking lock, man. Ash, come over here. I'm gonna give the shield to Sidfu because it's gonna be our hunter, our melee hunter. So let's go assign. Let's create a new outfit. It's gonna be called civilian. And civilians won't be able to wear shields. Where is shields? Shields over here. And also, no, full body suit. This is not it. Armor, 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 body suit. They can wear that if they want. Full armor. Well, I'm just gonna leave it like that. And I'm gonna give civilian to everyone. Except. Sidfu and Rebecca that they are our melee, fi melee fighters so check off spacecraft oh there's a whole bunch of spacecraft falling we still have to salvage some other spacecraft stuff where is it is this is this the thing that was meager shouldn't even bother Ooh, we have some bricks over here that we gotta salvage soon enough. So our colony is doing pretty well, guys. You know, um, food is not a concern anymore. We have enough food, we have enough animals on the map to, uh, uh, to guarantee a prosperous winter. We still need to get more apples, I think. Um, I'm gonna increase the fruit salad production just to make sure we have enough fruit salads and I think I'm gonna go with apples again select similar I'm gonna go to a different area now this area over here I don't need to go that far 
and I'm gonna tell them to harvest it. And with that we're gonna be creating a very nice stockpile of apples. Oh, they have drugs here. I wish there was a trader, you know, so we, so we can sell a little bit of stuff. Or... Do we have any other stockpile zones here? We don't. So, I think I'm gonna have to expand this a little bit. Shutter Kid Sifu is totally fine now. He's gonna be our hunter. Ooh, Space Marine, are you any good? No, she's not good. I'm not gonna mill... No, she's good with plants, but... We don't have plants right now. So, Seed Fu... Why are you not getting the Great Sword assigned? Oh, because I didn't tell you to. Come on, Sid. Great job. Um, who's our miner? I think Kid. No, Kid is not our miner. Even Rebecca is not good. The miners are are their initial people, which is fine. I think it's okay. All right, what a prosperous colony, huh? We are very well protected inside this trio, this triad of hills here. So it's not going to be easy to tackle us, uh, except if they come this way. But we also have this natural wall over here that gives us time to prepare. We could start thinking about taming some animals. Uh, it's a possibility. Uh, and we have enough uh, materials to create some rations for them. Uh, so we probably could uh, take care of them during winter. But I don't think I'm gonna I wanna do this right now. I wanna focus on our research. Now that we have Guga doing research, we are not hunting anyone else. And I think that's what I want to do. I think I want to hunt more. Let's see if there's more muffalos. If there aren't, I'm gonna go hunting for bucks. Because I'm gonna go hunting with seed foo. Uh, maybe we should go hunting for hams, right? Rim rams. Yes, let's go hunting. And I'm gonna do like this. I'm gonna go. Google, you won't be hunting. Seed, you will be hunting. And forget about research for a while. Uh, I'm also gonna try to hunt you guys over here. Let's bring some rim, rim, rim ram meat to the table. We are collecting fruit. Fruit is being collected. There's lots of apples. Lots and lots and lots of apples. Which is great. We are prepared for the next trader if it ever happens. We also have some peaches here. Raptors. Mm, this is not gonna be good. Except that they're very, very. There's two raptors. Oh, they're gonna be. They're gonna be eating. three raptors. We cannot handle have raptors right now. We don't have the weapon to handle safely those raptors. Maybe if we could get one. Uh, by the side, but there's enough food for them to keep hunting here. There's even some alpacas here, so they're probably not gonna bother us. Uh, let's see if Sidfu is going hunting. Oh, he's washing, he's not hunting. Well, it's five o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, restrictions we need to give. I think what we need is we need more. Set owner Rebecca. Nice. Now I'm gonna just tell that this is for guests, for guests, for guests, 
and this is my medical and my medical. I need better beds for medical uh, treatment, but we don't have enough l l reptile leather. So we finished tailoring one. Let's see if there's uh, if tortoises spawn on the map. No, they haven't. Yep, I should have raised them. I should have raised them. Good stuff. Good stuff. So we have two colonies, two colonists idle. Uh, I think this is it. This is the the time we have available for this episode. Uh, I was told that to make episodes a little bit shorter so people can uh, watch it with more ease. Uh, and I think we are progressing very well. This is episode. Oh, who needs treatment? Oh, seed fool. You tried to. What happened to you? Oh, you got headed. <laughs> but you are good at melee, aren't you? No, you suck. I think it's Collins that is good at melee, which is Ash. We <laughs> we we crapped. We just crapped here. You're gonna be doing research. Google is not gonna be doing research. We are solely gonna be doing research. Ash, what's your weaponry? You need the great sword. I messed this up. I really did. I really, really did. So I'm gonna take the sword out of Sidfu. And I'm gonna give it to Ash really quickly. It's really easy to do that. Where is the great sword? Great sword. Great sword. And then I'm gonna tell Ash to go hunting for animals, you know, melee wise. With 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 Ash's melee, he should have like one hit at that brim brim ram. We just sent seed food to his death, unfortunately. But as I was saying, the colony is doing fine. We have our freezer here. It's okay. Our kitchen is functional. Our quarters are a little bit better, a little bit more comfortable. Of course, we need to get those chunks out of here. I, I'm not sure why they're not carrying it over here. I think, oh, I think. They should carry those chunks over there. I need to give their orders. And I think for the next episode, in the next steps, start to get to get our main hall here uh, upgraded. You know, better floors, stuff like that, so we can start installing some lamps. Maybe think about uh, starting electrical projects, and even maybe uh, start to think about plumbing. You know, better ways to to have bathrooms and to have. Uh, 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 a place basins to wash your hands and stuff like that but this is all the time we have for now guys so i appreciate a lot you guys coming here and watching this so far in if you are please subscribe to the channel leave me a comment uh press that like button it helps a lot and you know it does um it's something that it's uh it means a lot to me not so much for you and it helps the channel a lot but the priority here is actually to let me know what you think about the gameplay and what you would what would you have done differently from what i've been doing so far i really want to know and maybe you can start another one with uh different goals uh set to our play all right this is my tiguga i'll be seeing you soon thanks a lot for watching